so we're doing me, and you might see my grandma in the background, and Madison, and another well, guy <laughs> that's helping us. Okay, I so. What else you need? Nothing. Huh? I think we're okay. I don't think we need anything else. Are you sure? Yeah, sure. Okay, so um, the first thing we'll need is flour, <laughs> sugar, um, baking powder, uh, vanilla extract, a pan, doesn't matter how big I think, we're just using like a 9 by 13 or something, and salt, um, we're just using this kind of cocoa, we don't have normal cocoa, I don't know, a measuring cup, a bowl, oh, and, um, coke, coke, Canola oil, you can use, we just use cocoa. And then we need eggs. I don't know how many eggs. We have eggs? How many eggs do we need? Oh no, two eggs. We need two eggs. Um, here, I got a mom. Okay. Where? Oh, they're right there. Okay, so we need one cup of sugar, one and a half cup of flour, one third cup of cocoa, we're just using this kind of cocoa, one fourth teaspoon of salt, one fourth teaspoon of baking powder. Um, you just mix it all, the, all together, then you'll add the eggs, the one and a half cup of um, oil. We use canola oil, and then one teaspoon of vanilla. Yes, let's make it. Okay. What's the first thing? Okay, um, first thing, one cup of sugar. So this is the sugar. Yeah, that's the sugar. One cup of it. So, oh, geez. Okay, my friend, I'm going to pour the one cup because I'm not good at fractions. <laughs> okay, there's a big cup. We're just going to mix it all together. I don't 
no, this might be this one. Oh, no. Mama, do you have like tablespoons and teaspoons? Mm -hmm. Tablespoons and teaspoons. Yeah. Um, one fourth teaspoon of salt. Just like. No, like the measure. <laughs> I can't guess. I don't know what that is. <laughs> Perfect. Oh, we may. That's kind of easier. Do you have We have technical difficulties. Well, food difficulties. This one's this small. This one's this small. So, um, the next ingredient is, I think, like, uh, one fourth teaspoon of salt. So, one fourth teaspoon of salt. That's what it says, I think. This is small. Teaspoon of salt. salt. You don't want to fill that up with salt. Uh, you want to do like a pinch of salt. Okay. It's gonna turn out salty. Do so like two this. pinches of like. So we're just gonna do two pinches of salt because we don't feel like measuring it. That's fine. Okay, it might be a little salty. So. Okay, next thing is. Um, one fourth teaspoon of baking powder. So, um, the baking powder. We need one fourth, I think. I don't know. It's okay, it's okay. One fourth teaspoon. Of baking I guess powder. I can guess. Yes, I can guess. I finally, you'll see <laughs> the teenager. Wow. 
wash her hands. Mm -hmm. I got now she's back in the bowl. Goodbye. <laughs> okay. We need one whole Madison. So we have that in there. Hi, Madison. Say hi. I see myself in there. You don't. <laughs> okay. Madison, you can come up now. Come on. <laughs> there you go. Now you can pour it. So come out of the bowl. Just hop out. Oh. <laughs> Just hop out. Here, guys, smile. Okay, we took a picture. <laughs> <laughs> That's so cute. She took it when, like, we were pouring this thing. She's like, oh, like, ingredients like scientists. Just like, whoa. Oh, shoot. I did mix it. Okay. Um, next we need... <laughs> okay. Next we need one teaspoon of vanilla. Pretty sure I got it. I don't know. Is there a teaspoon in this? Fill that up eight times. This so you equal a eight? teaspoon. Mm -hmm. Yes. Eight times? Yes. Because it's one eighth of a teaspoon. Okay, so we need a teaspoon of vanilla, but we only have a one fourth. Cup. One eighth? I don't know. This is one fourth. Oh, one fourth. Never Three. mind, then fill it up four times. Four times only? Yeah. Okay, I so thought it was an eighth. We're going to pull. You should probably do it over the bowl. Yeah, that's one. Which pour that in? That one? I would say that's about two. Okay. Be careful. Go slow. There you go. Okay. Two. Three. Oh, three. Yeah, you're right. Get a cap. Oh. That's fine. Just pour it in. It's just vanilla. It's just... Okay. Well, we have vanilla. Ah. <laughs> So good. I love the smell of it. I, I like the smell of cinnamon and vanilla. Those are my two favorite smells. I thought you could afford the whole thing there. It's like, okay. If you eat the vanilla, it tastes disgusting. If you eat cinnamon, it tastes disgusting. With other ingredients, it tastes good. Delicious. Okay, I think that's it. And I can mix it. Mix it with a the fork. With the egg for the fork. Oh, yeah. We need a fork. We're going to mix it with a fork. But we're also going to put it in our mixer. We're, we also have a mixer, as you can, as you can see, right here. So, but we're going to put this in to make sure you mix it all. It looks so cool. It smells disgusting. Oh, that smells good. No, it smells good. It's very vanilla. Mm -hmm. Scrape off the sides. There. Okay, slowly getting to the the texture that we wanted, but we're gonna put it in our mixer over there, um, just to make sure that we mixed it all. So I think that's about. You can mix it that much. Doesn't matter. And then we're gonna put it in the mixer. So stand by. Okay, let's go put it in the mixer. Yay. Is it still on? Yeah, it's still on. Okay, we're gonna put it in the mixer and we're gonna make another video because this one's too long and we can't like wait for it to cook and everything. So go see my other videos, because it might be uploaded already. See the second video that we make of part two of making homemade brownies. Hope you enjoyed part one. I know it was a little long, but bye.